There are many benefits of massage. Massage is one of the best things that you can do for your health. Here are a few of the reasons that massage is so good for you. One of the main benefits of receiving massage is the effect of reducing stress. The act of receiving a massage profoundly reduces the amount of stress, which is translated into your muscles being more relaxed, and also chemical changes in your body. An article in Newsweek cited several studies that measure the stress hormone called cortisol in subject saliva before and after a massage session. This study discovered a dramatic decrease in the level of cortisol after getting a gentle massage. Cortisol, which is produced when you are stressed, kills cells important for immunity. So when massage reduces your stress levels and hence the cortisol in your body, it may help you avoid getting a cold or another illness while under stress. The effects of stress are wide-ranging and experts suggest that stress plays a large part in many diseases. The stress-relieving effects of getting a massage can result in decreased anxiety, enhanced sleep, greater energy, improved concentration, improved circulation, and reduced fatigue. Massage can also help your muscles. Your muscles are controlled by your brain and primitive reflexes within the spinal cord. There are sensors within each muscle that monitor its length and contraction strength. Sometimes these sensors get a bit confused and keep a muscle in a state of tension that is below your level of control. Have you ever noticed that you are holding your shoulders up around your ears without even knowing it? This is a response to stress. And if you keep those muscles tight long enough, they will stay tight without you even trying. This unintended tension increase happens all over your body in small ways, sometimes because of stress and sometimes because of injury. Whatever the underlying reason, massage can help to reset the sensors in the muscles, reminding them to let the muscle relax and lengthen. If the level of tension is coming from a feedback loop in the spinal cord, massage can help to reset that system by stimulating chemicals in your spine that naturally block those signals, thereby cutting the circuit that keeps your muscles tight. Finally, the sensory feedback that you get while receiving a massage can help you become more aware of the parts of your body that you may have become unconscious of. Feeling the massage therapist's hands on your body is a great way to remind you on a conscious level to relax and let down. Massage is also wonderful for the circulatory system. Our blood nourishes every cell in our body, delivering oxygen and vital nutrients and taking away wastes. Sometimes the blood can get stagnant in certain areas, bringing less nutrition and taking away less waste products. This can happen because of gravity, for example. Your feet may become stagnant if you sit all day long, or when a muscle becomes chronically tense, it becomes hard and is less penetrable to fresh, oxygenated blood. By receiving massage, the old blood is squeezed out, allowing space for fresh, rich blood to rush in and nourish the tissues. This act of stirring up the blood is great for your cells and can revitalize areas that were starved for blood. It is in these sluggish areas that disease can grow, so getting fresh blood flow is a part of staying healthy. Massage also stimulates the vagus nerve, a nerve that regulates blood pressure. In a 2005 study at the University of South Florida, Hypertension patients who received 10 massages of 10 minutes each day over a three-week period showed significant improvements in blood pressure compared to a control group who simply rested in the same environment without any massage. The other benefit of massage is in helping to increase the flow of lymph in your body. By increasing the flow of lymph, you increase the rate that the body detoxifies and removes harmful substances from your tissues. Increasing lymphatic flow can help you to reduce any swelling in the body that you may have. Light massage strokes tend to increase lymphatic flow, where deeper, more vigorous strokes tend to increase blood circulation. Your massage therapist will know what is right for you.
Massage can help you avoid injury. Many muscle injuries occur only after the muscle has been suffering from tension for many months. With increased tension, the added load of exercise finally causes the tissues to fail. Increased tension can also affect other structures, like the discs in your spine. The spinal discs are designed to support the weight of your upper body, but if there is tension in your back, this can increase the pressure on the discs, causing them to bulge. So although massage can't help much to heal a disc that is already bulged, it can help remove any tension that could contribute to an injury. If you already have an injury, massage is an excellent adjunct to normal healing of a muscle strain. Oftentimes, when a muscle is injured, it tightens to protect itself. This tension decreases blood flow to the muscle, making healing more difficult. A few days after the initial injury, massage can help to loosen the muscle and increase blood flow. This can speed healing. Be careful, however, since your body may feel so good after getting a massage that you may overtax yourself. While massage can increase blood flow, decrease tension, and make the muscle feel better, every injury needs time and gentleness on your part to fully heal. There have been many studies that have concluded the benefits of receiving massage. Here are just a few. Medical school students at the University of Medicine and Dentistry at the New Jersey Medical School who were massaged before an exam showed a significant decrease in anxiety and respiratory rates, as well as a significant increase in white blood cell and natural killer cell activity, suggesting a benefit to the immune system. In 2003, researchers studied the effects of massage on people with nonspecific back pain. The result of the study showed that massage therapy produced better results and reduced the need for painkillers by 36% when compared to other therapies. Massage is an excellent way to ease back pain that is due to a muscular cause. Cancer patients undergoing chemotherapy have discovered the benefit of massage to reduce nausea, pain, and fatigue. Patients at Memorial Sloan Kettering Cancer Center reported reduced levels of anxiety, pain, fatigue, depression, and nausea after receiving massage. Some of the effects lasted for a full two days. In burn victims, massage therapy has been found to decrease the effects of anxiety, tension, depression, pain, and itching suffered by those people. Abdominal surgery patients have been found to recover more quickly after massage. In a 2006 study, researchers found that migraine patients had fewer migraines and slept better during the week that they received massage and three weeks following than did patients that did not receive massage. Another study of people with migraines found that massage decreased the occurrence of headaches, sleep disturbances, and distress symptoms. This study also found that massage increased serotonin levels which helped to regulate mood, sleep, and appetite. Autistic children showed less erratic behavior after massage therapy. The Touch Research Center is one organization that has done extensive scientific research into the benefits of massage. Through their studies, they've concluded that massage facilitates weight gain in preterm infants, enhances attentiveness, alleviates depressive symptoms, reduces pain, reduces stress hormones, improves immune function. Getting regular massage is a great benefit for your health. Regular massage helps reduce tension, maintain a healthy blood flow, and keep you in a state of relaxation. We recommend at least every two weeks, as it seems the benefits of massage start to build on themselves at that level, leading to a healthier you. If you have an injury, then you may want to get massage several times a week until the injury is fully resolved. If getting regular massage doesn't work for you, getting several sessions close together every few months is a good way to keep your body balanced.
Massage feels great, can make you more conscious of your body, can reduce the likelihood of injury, and keep your body operating in peak performance. Getting massage is one of the best things you can do for yourself. Enjoy a massage today.